so in the course of it, it's 20 years of Susan's life, who is this bombastic, brave, brilliant, obviously I'm madly in love with her, that's my job. She seems to maintain um, an optimism, uh, which I love, this naivety in her. Her, her aspiration that it's all gonna get better. She still has that in her bones. Where did she come from? I don't quite know where that, I mean, I don't know why I was so determined from the very beginning of becoming a playwright that it was women's lives that I wanted to put on the stage. Except obviously I'd been brought up in an all-female household and so I was interested in women from the start and it just seemed to me so obvious that women's lives were so interesting and mysterious that nobody was writing about them. I was brought up at the time when there were so many films about the Second World War and so much drama about Second World War, none of which seemed to me true. When I found out about Special Operations Executive and the women who worked for it, it seemed to me that women had been stretched and completely, every part of them had been used in their work during the war. And then uh, when the war was over, they felt wasted and unfulfilled. And that seemed to me a terribly interesting subject to write about.